rack or a valet with a shoe rack and look at watch what she's doing she's keeping it in the laundry room so she's got things on the bottom shelves but she can hang up things that need to dry you might want to use this out by your pool you know and obviously bring it in at night but there you can hook all kinds of things from it. So if you tend to hang things to dry, you're going to love it. It might be in your mudroom where you end up putting the kids' book bags and such like that, although many of them aren't going to school, but there you go. <laughs> anyway, it's the multi-purpose entryway valet with the easy racks. We have two colors to choose from. This color right here is actually called black maple. And both of these are in the black coated uh, steel right here. But that one's called maple. And this one is called stone. The stone is definitely more gray. The maple has more of a brown tone to it. It's V37363, three payments of $32.55. And we're going to go off to Erica Swineford. She was joining us earlier today. Erica, what are you seeing in the shower? We're going to go off to Erica Swineford. She was joining us earlier uh, for the shower. But now for this piece, let's talk about this. This one I've never seen till today. And I was trying to think about all the different ways I could use it, but I could really use your your help with that too. Yes, absolutely, Mary Beth. I love this piece from Honey Can Do. It is so versatile. Um, first of all, it looks great and it really adds um, kind of that little bit of home decor element to your home, to your foyer, to your entryway, to right inside your mudroom door. But I love it, the versatility, because it's seating, first of all. You see me sitting on it, it holds up to 300 pounds. It's storage, you can hang or place up to six pairs of shoes on these two shelves. It's storage in hanging, um, this hanging sense, because it has eight hooks that hold 15 pounds each. And then even the crossbar where you can hang clothes if you place this in your bedroom and you wanna air dry things on hangers or in the laundry room. But I just love it because especially right now, I think so many of us are leaving our shoes at the door. We're taking off right. our shoes when we get home from school or work yeah. or errands or shopping um, to kind of leave those germs at the door as well. And this is a great place to do that because you can sit right. if you need, you know, a little help getting mm -hmm. your shoes on and off. You have all this great storage and then you have all of the storage up here, up top, for you know, maybe that everyday coat that you wear, the umbrella, the scarves, the hats, mittens, gloves, and right. the handbag. That's so brilliant. I want to give you the size of this because you mm -hmm. may need to run over somewhere and measure, you know, a piece of the wall kind of thing in one of the rooms that you're already thinking about. So from one side to the other across, it's 28 and a half inches, 28 and a half inches. The height of this is 68 and a half inches, 68 and a half from floor to the top. And then on the depth from front to back, this direction, it's 13 and a half inches. And this is actually easily cleaned, isn't it? When we were talking about throwing the shoes on there, you can tell it's it's the kind that you can just wipe off. And it's not, even if like the shoes had snow on them or wetness on them, it's not gonna hurt this. Absolutely, and I just love it because it's just that little bit of extra storage that so many of us need. So, mm -hmm. you know, if you throw that coat that you wear every day on top of a chair when you come in the door or, you know, your purse on the kitchen island, this is kind of that catch-all place for the pet yeah. leash, for the car keys, for your everyday handbag, the pair of shoes that you wear every day, your coat, and you know, maybe maybe nowadays you don't wanna hang that coat that you wear to work every day mm -hmm. in your coat closet with your other things. This is just an easy, simple option yeah. to kind of hang it, let it um, kind of air out overnight. Um, and it looks good while it's doing it. So it's working for you, it's st storage, it's seating, but it's looking good all the while. Um, you were saying that the weight capacity is 300 pounds, so there's plenty of weight on here. Um, yes. It also is nice that like if you sit down, there's a little handle there. But I wanted to ask what kind of con um, assembly is there when I get this home? Absolutely. So it's a simple assembly. Mary Beth Honey Can Do tries to keep everything as simple as possible. So you're going to screw in these, this upright post and you'll get the, um, the Allen wrench to do that. So easy and simple. Um, shouldn't take more than an hour or so at most. Okay. But it's just a great a great piece to add all yeah. that storage and functionality in your home with a little bit of flair. And yeah. if you're somebody that likes to sit down to take your shoes on and off, I know sometimes, you know, we're standing by the door, like kicking our shoes off and our yeah. rain boots and kind of falling over. Right. This is a great place to be able to just sit down, 
you know, take, put your shoes on and off, do it simply, safely and yeah. easily, and then head out the door. Think about any door area coming and going where this might work best. The other thing is think about closets because sometimes you have a long closet and so there's kind mm -hmm. of that wasted wall at the end of the closet and you've got hanging here and hanging there. This might be exactly what fits in there that is so brilliant. And so think about the different rooms of your home. This makes great sense. The price tag is $76.20 and you can break that down to, into three monthly payments of $25.40 and you just decide do you want the maple color or the stone color the maple is more brown the stone is more gray that's going very very quickly Erica thank you so much for your help today thanks Mary Beth happy organizing and you too well listen we've got another look at our today's special value yet to come